<laughs> ah, since you're here, you want to make yourself useful? Not particularly. Listen, son, I know you got a mission. But right now, I need another gun. Why? What's happening? We've had this problem for months with this group of bandits who are getting drunk and murdering settlers. Last night, they went to a big place up near Ridgewood. They burnt the place down, killed the men, burning most of them alive, and raped the women. Women folk then got their throats slit. One of them survived and walked in here this morning. Anyway, we got a posse gathering up near Ridgewood. Will you ride with us? All right. Thank you, John Marston. It's gonna be a bloody job. Huh. I don't think I know any other kind, sir. Hey, wait up! Let's go! All right, boys, let's move it out. First, I hear you caught up with Mr. West Dickens. I did. For a man who claims to have found a remedy to all ailments, he was in pretty bad shape. His tonic has helped a great many people. It's a medical breakthrough from the East. The result of years of research. If only it could cure him of his diarrhea of the mouth. I wouldn't be so dismissive of science if I was you. I'm just changing the past. He's no more a scientist than I am a priest. But people can spend their hard-earned money however they please. He's certainly a character, that West Dickens. I can't understand a goddamn word he said. A more flannel mouthed bunko artist I've never met. Might just be a dead critter. Marston, take a look. Eli, you too. Come on. Ain't no survivors here, Marshal. Man, this don't look too good. Somebody was so busy killing people, they went and dropped their gun. such a thing. Any number of people. Especially now the word's out we're cleaning up the county. Between Wolf, boys, and the rustlers, we've been spilling a lot of blood. Man gets more evil when he's running scared. Yeah! Let's go! Four vultures! We best take a look, boys. Still smoking. Those scumbags must still be around. Come on. Come on, let's ride. They kind of got too far. Sons of bitches. Outlaw, Marston. Yeah, but not like that. It wasn't our way. At least it wasn't my way. Killing and thieving's never right, boy. No matter how you dress it up. Unless it's ordered by a court of law, you mean? You know as well as I do, Marshal. One way or another, some men gotta die. This is too quiet. I got a bad feeling about this. Let's search the area. Shed's clear, Marshal. Shoot that door open. Holy 
sweet mother of mercy. Please, please don't shoot me. Some bandits came by and took us hostage. They're holed up in the farmhouse. Some of my family is being kept hostage inside. <laughs> All right, boys, we need to get into that house right now. Great. Now what next? Fun. Deputy waiting for you in the shed out back. Make a run for it when it's clear. Break to the shed when the coast is clear. There'll be a deputy waiting for you. Thank you. They said they were going to kill us Are you all. kidding? Look like that's all of them. Hellfire! of that bunch gets fifty dollars it ain't about the money marshal these are people's lives people's homes let's go get on your horse boy follow me come on Let's just say he's the currency in a complicated transaction. What the hell are you talking about? Some people I have the displeasure of knowing want him dead. Why does that involve you? We used to run in a gang together. It was once like family. If this is how you treat your family, I'd hate to see what you do to your enemies. That was a lifetime ago. And bear in mind, he's left me for dead the last two times I've seen him. I'm about bigger and we move past the family part. Eyes up! You see that? You just walk away now, John. I didn't kill you before, but I sure as shit will now! Get yourself down here, Bill. You know you ain't man enough to stop me. <laughs> you know I don't want to kill you, but I will. You always did have a high opinion of yourself, John. <laughs> Dutch always said you were an arrogant son of a bitch. I guess he was about right. Get him, boys! Everybody, take cover! In that shed!
I warned you, didn't I? Hey, look what I got here. <laughs> There's something that you're still breathing. <laughs> Come here, boy. <laughs> Come on, Bessie. Give. <laughs> oh. Norman Deke. <laughs> Nice to see you again, buddy. Thanks for your help, John. Norman here is gonna help us get to Bill. <coughs> Ain't you, Norman? Thank you, Mr. Dick. Mighty kind. Fuck you! Hog time. Let's get him to jail. <laughs> <laughs>